anybody over. Didn't panic. He just decided, man, I'll do this myself. I'm going to use my wheels and put up six on the board. He did just that. On the run from inside his own five. Got a little room. Wide open, and it's a foot race. They won't get him. It's a touchdown. That dude ought to have a lethal sticker on his helmet. Any time he touches it, it can be a score. Touched it, and it was. Give to the running back. They get him stopped at the 26, but boy, that was an attitude running. Got six on first down. Now a lot of options on second and four. Using his left to buy some time. Grab near the sticks. It's Montgomery. The offense. Looking to move it through the air. It's caught. It's a touchdown. And this offense gets on the board in the first passing touchdown of the season. And I feel pretty confident saying, personal lady, this offense looks like they're in a good rhythm. And this passing attack's going to be hard to stop. Lining up for the PAT. Right down the boulevard. So that scoring drive took over. More guys to the box, more guys to the run. Then you open it up for the passing. Off play action. Bought a little time, lets it go. It's complete to the right. And they wrap him up, but not before he gets enough on the catch for the first down. So, so close to cashing it in for this offense. Turning to the running game on first and goal. They bring him down, and he's going to lose a yard on that one. How about the defender being a heat-seeking missile? He was on radar lock. He found the football and flew down with some bad intentions. And to the end zone for a touchdown. And I just love the execution by this offense. Late in the half, man, you want to take the lead. You want to get that momentum on your side. And then... Here's the snap, looking to throw. Buys a little extra time. Let's it go to the end zone. And good coverage there to knock it away and deny the score. This seems to be a chip shot field goal attempt and a routine three points, but they will go for it on fourth down. Moving, keeping the eyes downfield. And into the end zone for a touchdown. And the defense is so close. They had done such a good job up to that point. They're setting up a fourth down. Now, it looked like they had the QB corral, but they let him escape. That is going to be a coaching moment for them. To attempt to try. And after that extra point, we have a tie ball game in the third quarter. 45 pounds of heat seeking missile. Looking for an open area to his left. Got some room in to the goal line. They'll get him stopped just short of the end zone, but they're in business here with a first down. So now the opportunity with a touchdown to take the lead. They'll run it on first and goal. Sprints into the end zone for a touchdown. Man, what a great job by the Suns executing down the field, using all of the clock, being smart, getting the big score late, and I think that one should do. They'll try to add another incomplete pass, and one second remains. No time to waste here. They've got to get set and pick up chunk yardage. Right back up top on second and ten. Falls incomplete. They fought to the final whistle, but that's going to do it. Looking back, this game probably falls precisely into the definition of a trap game. Trap was set, sprung, and the underdogs come up. His rankings don't mean a lot to a lot of people, and you can tell it didn't mean a lot to this team, and that's why they came out and pulled the upset. Absolutely, David. I mean, that's why you play the games. This team knew they had to come out. They were going to have to put their best foot forward in order to get the W. They did just that. Their talent.